Here's an interesting tweet from our colleague John Wertheim. This is a little inside baseball, but bottom line is the U.S. and Australia, they kind of trade wild cards uh, for their grand slams. And John doesn't think this is such a good idea, essentially looking at who is likely to get the U.S. wild card into the Australian Open. Jimmy, do you want to chime in on this? Do you think this is a good practice or not? Um, no, of course it's okay. I don't mind having us trade wild cards and giving our some of our players a chance. And Ben Shelton, I think, is a guy that's going to be top 30 in the world next year. So he's a guy that has incredible weapons. If he's the guy that gets a wild card, more power to him. I can't actually read what that quote says. So <laughs> he's you know, kind of ranking far away who's for most me. likely to get it. And Vicky, okay. it's done based on results in challengers, the way the U.S. does it. So there's actually some some science behind it. Yeah, and I think it's a great thing for the players. Obviously, the wild cards are generally on merit base, and I think if the players are doing well and they earn their spot into the tournament, to have that trade back and forth, I think is a great thing for both countries.